Kia ora team, welcome back to another video. I'm Daniel and I hope that you fellas are having a good day, dressing well and of course getting stuff done. In today's video we are doing another 100 pound ASOS challenge outfit summer Oh, it's a mouthful when it does come to challenge videos i normally try like if you've seen in the past try push the limits a bit like try like go outside of my comfort zone and things like that but what i really want to do in today's video is actually see if i can get an outfit from asos for 100 pounds or less of something that i would literally wear like an outfit that i would truly wear on the daily and feel you know like really comfortable and so that's the goal today is to see if i can get something that really does match my style fits me well and you know just looks good all around one thing to clarify first guys i am going to be shopping for london's summer i noticed in the 10 like simple outfits uh for summer there was quite a few of you commenting below like, oh, you couldn't wear this in my country you couldn't wear this you couldn't wear this blah 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 not summer outfits and the thing is I don't live in your country, I live in London and that's how I dress and that's how I plan these outfits. Remember, these are all just ideas, guys. I'm not showing you exact outfits that you should wear. With fashion, it is about putting your own spin on it, dressing for your own climate, your own environment and everything like that, okay? So I just give you guys the ideas. It's still up to you to kind of like put your own spin on things. So yeah just know that today i'm still shopping for london's summer now that that's out of the way i've got the laptop we have a hundred pound limit let's get on to asos all right we've got that screen recording started so pretty much my process with this one is i'm gonna kind of just start off with asos design stuff because asos the website itself has a ton of brands a ton of stuff so if you don't narrow things down enough you're going to be on here for ages so that's what we're going to be doing first okay so keeping in mind that i'm trying to go for something very wearable we are going to go to clothing actually no we're not let's go to brands let's go to brands asos design that's like all of like asos's kind of like stuff and already here you see there's still 13,246 items so we need to limit the hell out of this i'm not going to do shorts guys like it is hard for me to find really good shorts i like the only ones i like are the ones from um on place or on place or i'm saying it wrong okay i want trousers and we're gonna go for jeans as well oh, but you can't wear those in my country uh move to london you can kind of wear anything whenever so already i've limited down which is taking the search to only now 1246 uh let's do sizes as well because that is an important one boom again now that's already taken it down to 677 um colors i don't really know size done price range i'm not going to do but what we're going to do because 100 pound limit i'm going to go from low to high so it's going to show me the cheapest first and now we can really start going through it we're going for simplicity so let's speed run through this so asos tapered smart trousers and ice gray asos navy i'm just going to open quite a few tabs see those are cool um but i know i wouldn't really wear them on the daily so i'm trying to really go for a, like a daily wear even though this might look so basic to you guys do you know what i'm going to do as i kind of just realized i'm going to move out of the way now we can actually have a bigger screen here that makes a lot more sense right Okay, let's keep going through. I'm gonna go into jeans because there could be other brands that do really cheap. Okay, so I'm looking for jeans. Boom, 12 pounds. I like the color of those. Nice indigo. Kind of do want my jeans to be a bit brighter though because um, it is still like a summer fit. What are these? ASOS designs. Ooh, that's a nice color. The Collusion one's 12 pounds. These look like a nice fit, although I feel they're gonna be a bit too dark for what I want. Um, I've got the note ones these i do really like the colorway of them and then also asos i think i'm gonna stick with these ones for now let's go linen trousers linen will be very light and breathable and very thin so if you guys do live in a hotter country that's something you can look at we're not gonna like i'm because you guys don't need to see me shop i'm gonna go through and i'm gonna obviously open up quite a few things that i do like okay so i've got the pants that i'm considering boom boom Boom. Now tops is definitely one I'm gonna narrow down a lot more. So I'm gonna go back to the brands. I'm gonna go to ASOS White. ASOS White is a bit of their like higher end kind of like range thing, um, like a little bit better quality. The thing is I still gotta keep the price range in mind and that's kind of what I'm forgetting about right now. All right, so the tops that I'm kind of looking at, as you see, it's just the price range here, but we do have this like cool boxy shirt, obviously just a standard loose fitting uh, t-shirt. Got a very nice kind of like jacket. Cause I'm thinking like a jacket just for the evening if I can fit it in and then a nice white shirt and then also another shirt here. I think I've got in mind what I'm gonna do. 
um, I'm looking for a jacket. Let's go find a jacket. Again, we're gonna do the same thing. Um, price low to high, because we're trying to stick in with that budget. Okay, so if I were at 20 pounds and I'm not feeling any of these, vest is cool. So you guys, you can make 22 pounds for a vest. I was actually telling my friend the other day, like we saw this really cool vest in a store and it was worth 400 something pounds. I was like, you can just find that exact same thing, especially because they're still kind of like on trend and stuff like right now, like a utility vest. You find that stuff online, like ASOS does great versions. Like when something's a trend, I think looking on ASOS and stuff is a good place to go because it's not, you're not gonna probably be wearing it for that long, like a year max. Okay, so the jackets that we're looking at, we do have this utility vest, which is a vest not a jacket. Um, then we have this zip up, zip up jacket in a checkered gray that I'm kind of looking at. Also this Heart and Dragons, it is a skinny denim, denim. I might see if there's a, just on like a same price type one with it's not skinny denim. Uh, that'll be too tight on my arms. And then we do have this really nice one from Collusion. Again, that's like a nice oversized, very similar actually to my Carhartt one. So if you guys have like really a fan of the Carhartt one I thrifted, this Collusion one, 25 pounds, cheers. Bam. So I'm not gonna show you guys exactly what I've ordered, but I have ordered it. So I've put it under is next day delivery. So we're just gonna skip to tomorrow if it comes. So uh, I'll see you fellas tomorrow. Man, I wish I could fly. It'd be so cool. We'll teleport. Teleport go quicker. I'm flying them in the sky and it's free and then teleport fast. Fast, fast or free. Fast, free, fast, free. Oh, ASOS. Hey bro. Yeah, what's up man? So I've got a delivery for uh, Mr. Daniel, I... Uh, what are those? What a... What a... What? what? Uh, sandals? I know they're sandals, I'm just... Why would you... Why would you wear them with socks, bro? I just guess I, I like them. I don't know, they're just socks and sandals, my guy. <laughs> yeah, sure you like them, bro. I delivered to plenty of fashion tools. Here you go. These are... Bloody kids in their fashion these days. My grandma could probably dress better than that fool. Hey. All right, so it is the next day, guys. Also, neighbors have got their, you know, like hedge trimmer thing out. So sorry if you can hear all that stuff. But it is the next day. We have the package from ASOS. So, do you guys want to see what I got? I don't even know if I'm doing it along the line. Oh, there we go. In total, I ended up spending 98 pounds. Here is a quick screenshot so you guys can see. I ain't cheating it. This is what we got. We got a total of four items for 98 pounds, a full outfit. I got pants, I got a shirt, I got a jacket, and I got an accessory. Shoes, I'm gonna do myself. I'm not gonna mess around with shoes on a website. So first up, we'll start with the pants. I ended up going for Only and Sons um, Slim, so. We'll see how that actually fits. Uh, beige pants in a linen material. So these are very nice and lightweight. I mean, the color the color's nice. I did first time I'm seeing this shit too, guys. Because these were slim, I was like, ah, I'm gonna size up. So I actually went for a 34 waist. I wouldn't really suggest you guys to do that. Uh, but for me, again, I can put a belt through and it's also got the drawstrings. Um, and that is just because the size of my thighs. Uh, so if you guys do have like bigger legs and stuff like that, it's something you can look at doing. Uh, so hopefully these will actually fit nicely. These were the most expensive item that I got and they came in at 38 pounds. Then the shirt I ended up going for, again, going for that summer vibe. I got an ASOS white loose fitting shirt and it's in this kind of like textured um, color. Again, my all sizes are actually sold out in this. So <laughs> I would have gone for a large because it is loose fitting, but I sized up to extra large. So again, fit might not be fully on. So this came in at 26 pounds and so far, it's like kind of like a creamy white. It looks good, it feels nice. It's, I actually really like that. I hope it fits. I, I do, like I know it'll fit because I wear oversized clothing, but I mean like I hope it doesn't look too oversized because I think so far, I mean, well, duh, that beige and white, it's good so far. Because it's a summer inspired outfit, I did want to go for the lighter colorways. As you see, I've got beige pants and a white t-shirt. That just really like, kind of like screams summer vibes. But then I also did get a denim jacket. Now the denim jacket I got is from the ASOS design brand. This came in at 30 pounds. Now may, you may be like, why are you getting a jacket in summer? I really want an outfit that's versatile and, oh, I'm gonna sneeze. <laughs> I really want an outfit that's versatile and can go from day to night. Like I said, this is for London weather and 
yeah, this is nice. What was it? What did I say? It was 30, 30 pounds. Got it in a size large, went true to size with it. Uh, this will just be a nice kind of like contrast to the whole entire outfit. I feel to like chuck on more in the evening. So that's pretty good. Then the final thing I got, because there was still some money left over, I picked up an accessory, which is this tote bag right here. Again, just so the outfit just goes together, that beige. Um, the one I went for says, it was either this one, uh, this one says ASOS design on it, but if you don't want, you know, the brand to be seen, you just wear it on the inside, won't really be shown. Um, I love tote bags as an accessory and also just obviously a functional uh, purpose. And I feel this really still ties in with the whole entire outfit. So those are the four items I picked up. I spent a total of 98 pounds, two pounds under budget and so far, so good. What we're gonna do now, we're gonna go onto the streets, wear the whole entire outfit, show you guys a little bit of B-roll, and then we'll sum it up outside my overall thoughts on this. So, let's get to outside. outfit that I put together. So all up for 100 pounds, I'm pretty happy with it. Um, I was able to stay under budget. I was able to stick roughly to my style. And I believe that everything came together quite well. If there's a lot of like background noise and wind and stuff, unfortunately we don't have the mic. We're just shooting this straight raw. Uh, so just bear with me. Now what I would say guys is that when you are spending 100 pounds or less for a full entire outfit, you just have to be aware that the quality that you're getting might not be there. But I just wanted to show you that you can still put a fit together when you are on that budget. But yeah guys, all up, I'm pretty damn happy with how it came together. Uh, my favorite piece definitely was, weesh. My favorite piece of them all definitely was this white shirt, which was an ASOS white collection. Uh, pretty much because of the price and everything. It, to me, it doesn't feel like it's from ASOS, like ASOS's brand. Quality is there, you know, it's a nice heavyweight. I love the texture of it and kind of that off-white color. Uh, so, I, you know, I'm pretty chuffed with that. Now, the black uh, denim jacket, I think that was a bit too, like, full-on black for the whole entire outfit. I think it uh, contrasted too much. Uh, if that was maybe like a washed black or like a vintage, you know, that vintage washed uh, black, I think it would have gotten a little bit harder. Pants, waist is obviously way too big, but the pants do fit my thighs. And that is key. I've got my belt literally cranked the hell up right now. But yeah, guys, overall, 100 pounds. I think I did good. Let me know in the comment section below what you guys thought of the outfit I put together. And also let me know in the comment section below where should I do this challenge next. Other than that, guys, have an amazing day. And I'll see you fellas next time. Peace.